previously on Final Fantasy VII Remake. Show it to me. <laughs> oh my God! And now back to my childhood. Hello! The sneak up bee. Back with some more Final Fantasy VII Remake. First of all, I just want to throw out there, I know that normally I would be doing more Hunter Hunter, um, just in case some of you didn't see my tweets or when I posted in the community page, but I just want to throw out there for just a little bit, uh, Hunter Hunter is uh, uh, postponed. I need to get, gather together some information. I'm trying to figure some stuff out because I honestly initially thought I might have to stop it, sadly, but I've sort of learned some stuff that might actually be in my favor that actually might be all right from this point on. But I, like I said, I kind of trying to figure out certain aspects and certain parts of it before I, I go talking about it and, and tell you about it. So, but I'll keep you guys updated. Hopefully I figure things out here uh, soon. And the moment I do, I will let you guys know. But when we last left off, oh my God almighty, this freaking scene, man. This whole section, honestly. God damn it. It was, it was better than I ever could have dreamed ever could have dreamed i like a, i initially went into this thinking that i was afraid they might tone down the whole dress scene but they made it even more ridiculous than it was in the original and i love them for it cloud going up there and dancing in like this insane freaking synchronized dance with andrea it's like a scene ticket straight out of like a disney movie or something and then Cloud ends the, the dance with a fucking dab. He's like, Arr! and God damn it, he looks so fucking gorgeous. But yeah, so I've seen the other dresses now for, for Cloud as well. Um, what I sort of taken from it. So basically there are two sets of side quests in this, in this area. One that involves uh, Sam and one that involves uh, uh, Madam M. Which one you get depends on the answers that you give to certain things earlier. Um, I don't know exactly the specifics, but there's basically two sides of quests that you can only do in a single playthrough. So... Which is pretty cool, actually. I do kind of like that. So basically, you get like the dresses that you get for for doing either of those sides, and then the dresses, and then the dress that you get if you don't really do much of anything, right? It's kind of like the plain dress, kind of like what uh, like Aerith had. And it was something funny. I actually look when I I went and watched the videos for when Aerith got her her other dresses, and they're like much more toned down. Like basically, you didn't like you didn't do anything in Sector Five. You get like the the basic bitch dress right and she walks out and people are like oh ugh. they're like grossed out or something by her and then the one where she's like oh it's pretty good you know there's some people and uh john is like yeah it looks nice and so like that and then there's this one where you know he throws out the red carpet confetti's coming down there's crowds of people oh i do like that i like that that the work that you put in there is like paid off in such a grandiose fashion but yeah so i got the dress for cloud here for uh doing sam's route basically which does make me wonder then though is it really gonna affect what don corneo uh like who he picks or maybe that's determined when i go in there may I have to make like certain choices in front of uh the don for him to pick you or there's like a mini game i don't know or maybe there's no choice here maybe it's just it plays out the same every time but in the original game, they he could pick. I think he could pick either Era or Tifa, or maybe he always picked like one or the other. I I, I can't remember. But he but if he didn't like get Klaus dressed to look pretty enough, uh, he would pick one of the other girls. But if you did, he would pick you, and it was freaking hilarious. Uh, but anyway, last episode, uh, Namified said <laughs> Cloud dances and transforms himself into a girl. Meanwhile, at Seventh Heaven, Jesse Jesse frantically stands up from her seat. Biggs, what's wrong, Jesse? Je Jesse, I feel like I'm missing out on the most important moment of my life. Jesse dashes towards the door. Wait, Jesse, what about the mission? Fuck the mission. <laughs> yes. Oh, my God. I know if Jesse could see this, she would fuck Cloud right there on the goddamn spot. She's like, I'm a lesbian now. <laughs> Lord knows. Jesse, out of every, everyone in this group, she's the thirstiest for Cloud. All right. She would fuck Cloud on the damn spot if he let her. Right. If he went to her house that one night and had that pizza, you know, they would have fucked like monkeys and it would have been glorious. But now I'm fine. <laughs> Thank you so much for shedding a line on what Jesse was doing in this moment. You know that's you know that shit happened, all right? She's gonna walk off that fucking sprayed leg of her. She's like, fuck this, go in it. And as for that reason, you are comment of the day. Uh, I loved Aerith's response to Don't say anything. She's like, not even a word. No. <laughs> but you're so cute. <laughs> oh god, guys. This game's so magical. Like, I just I'm so happy. I'm so happy this game is turning out as amazing as it as I always hoped it would be. 
Like, I thought this was a fucking pipe dream. But, man, some of these guys are... They're not just, like, meeting my expectations. They're exceeding my expectations. That's just... Fuck, man. That's just crazy. That's crazy. But, all right. So, uh, we're going to head in here now. She's going to play out. I actually remember uh, the Don from the trailer... And I remember initially thought it was voiced. It was a guy voiced by Mark Hamill. It sounded like Mark Hamill when he talked. Uh, but you guys actually said it, it, it's actually not. It's, it's some other voice actor who has actually done a ton of roles, like a metric shit ton of like roles. I think it said like, like two thousand voice roles or something. So uh, clearly a uh, a uh, veteran voice actor. Maybe he's doing his Mark Hamill impression because I swear to God he sounded like him in that trailer. Uh, but I went ahead and equipped Tifa with some materia because uh, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be fighting with her. Uh, pretty soon here. I just can't wait to see Tifa's reaction. <laughs> also, uh, well, they still have the sex dungeon from like they had the original. They it, it literally had a sex dungeon in the original. I I didn't know that as a kid. I did. I, I had no idea what that was when I played through this as a kid. It wasn't until many years later later that I looked back and I went, "Oh my god, this is a sex dungeon! What the fuck, Fall Fantasy Seven? <laughs> Poor little young Nico had no idea what kind of crazy, dirty shit probably went on down there. All right, here we go. You know, I mean, to be fair, I don't look that much different than I did before. I feel like these guys up front should know that it's still me, right? In the original game, they didn't. They were like, oh, whoa, who's this chi sexy chick with the same kind of hair? And as the guy that was just uh, threatening us earlier. Hi, young Seth. No way. Here you are. Letters from Andrea Rodea and Madam M. That no, he right? he knows it's you serious. Is there a problem? Yep. I hope you know what you're in for. <laughs> oh, we'll be fine. Okay. If you say so. Come on. Okay, so he's not that stupid this time. I like that though. I, I like that because it's clear that this guy doesn't like the Don, right? He thinks he's a scummy sleaze bag, but it's a job to him. So he's just he rolls with it. But now he's like, oh, he sees the he sees what my plan in is here. Oh boy. Oh god, this shit is. I have a feeling about to get immensely insane. The two of you here for the audition? Oh, music Second kicking floor, in. At the very end of the walk. And don't go poking your nose in where it doesn't belong. Did it? Did it? Did it? Did it? Did it? Rooms on the Is second that coral over there? The very end of the wall. Wait, I want to go to the sex dungeon. I think it normally is over here. Or is it behind the counter? Yeah, in the original game, it was it was over right here, I, b I believe. Or maybe, or no, maybe it was upstairs and down. Uh, I don't know. Welcome to the mansion of the esteemed. Don Welcome Corday. to the mansion, esteemed. Yeah. Welcome to the mansion of the esteemed. Don this is where Sylvain <laughs> does uh, part-time work. Yeah, you, you just get a class. You just let like, know the way I like my girls. Mm. Oh God, I don't know who that is, but I. Damn! Is that the guy with the? We've been waiting for you to show. It is. It's the guy that we fought before with the dogs. He was actually a Don Corneo Canea lackey too. I'm gonna go in here. Hey, hands to yourself. Okay, I guess I'm not. That Andrea's girl? I'd let her do things to me. <laughs> God damn! Go to your room and wait quietly. Dun 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 dun. Okay. All right. God, everyone here is so nice. Wow, nice room. Huh? What's that weird, sweet smell? Uh oh. And why do I feel so dizzy? Gas. <gasps> Come on. Damn it. Damn. Don, Don trying to roofie us? What the fuck? That's fucked up, man. Dude, that's fucked up. What the shit? Oh god, they take us to the sex dungeon. Oh, 
I'm gonna throw down. But if you leave a mark on him, you ain't getting off with a one. I know. Managed to wrangle some real lookers this time, though. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hey, can you hear me? <gasps> oh, oh my God. Tifa looks so fucking good, cute. <laughs> oh my God. I love her outfit so much. Tifa? Yes? You okay? Oh my God. Mm -hmm. She doesn't realize it yet, does she? Good. Wait a minute. <laughs> Cloud? Is that you? Oh my God. That makeup and that dress. Nailed it. I know. Thank you. Moving on. <laughs> Game. I know. I nailed it. Fuck. All right. I got it. I'm fucking Rocky. I know. We all know. Anyway, moving on. <laughs> yeah, we are in the sex dungeon. Yeah, bit woozy, but I'll manage. <sighs> hey, Tifa. How you doing? Uh Okay. <laughs> oh, right. I'm Aerith, a friend of Cloud's. <laughs> we were worried and thought we'd come help you out. Uh, thanks. Just like in the original. We gotta leave. She's just like immediately becomes right friends now. with Tifa. No. She got Tifa. I got what I came for. What? So, after we made it back to the slums, some guys came around asking all kinds of questions. So I did some digging. And found out they were Corneo's men. Right. They were oh. in but I couldn't figure out why. So I thought I'd come and ask the man himself. Seriously? Thought if I could find a way in and get some one-on-one -on -one time, but then I realized I'd only be one of three right. candidates, and that if he didn't pick me, it would all be for nothing. That's right. I actually think I remember this. I think that was in the original. But they didn't. We didn't see that moment where the where some guys were coming in looking for for Barrett. That was. Uh, I kind of forgot about that. They they sort of glossed over this like why Tifa's here, what she's trying to do. But I think she does mention that in the original. So I I see. So those guys, the Don Corneo's men that I ran into back at the town. That it was just showing that scene. That that that's how the he there was actually an involvement there. I kind of forgot though. I I think that's what it was. I I think that was actually that way in the original too. Then your worries are over, aren't they? Because the other two candidates are right here, right? Yeah. Right. Not right. Well, yeah. If we're all in on it, then nothing can go wrong. Uh, I guess not. You, me, Cloud? Makes no difference who gets chosen, does it? <laughs> or you later. Know, Aerith. It feels wrong getting you involved in all this. Don't even bother trying to talk her out of it. <laughs> oh, Cloud gets me. <laughs> Took you long enough. <laughs> This is amazing. Holy fuck, Tifa looks cute as shit. So what happens now? I think they'll call for us when it's time. Please tell me this there's room gives me the creeps. Please tell me there's fan art of Tifa in this outfit, because this outfit is absolutely amazing. Tifa, you're so cute. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, I like she's like, she knows I'm looking at her outfit. She well. Now ladies, listen up. I'm sure you're still feeling a bit woozy, but tonight's audition's about to begin. Head out the door to the left and up the stairs. Come on, ladies. Let's hustle. God damn it, Tifa. I love you right, so guys. much. Let's do this. <laughs> do you want to do this? <laughs> I like, like, I'm just standing there. She's like, well, what do you think? Uh, 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 uh. That should be, Clive's reaction should be the same reaction he gave to Aerith when, he, when she came up. It's like, oh. <laughs> She's just over there posing for Cloud. God damn it. These girls love Cloud so much. Well. Damn. You look good. All right, Aerith. So? So. <laughs> oh, my God. I like they're both kind of posing for Cloud. Like, what are you picking me, you know? Come on. You know you're into this. <sighs> These girls. They want him so bad. What the hell is that over there? Damn, so cute. I love this. I love this game, man. Oh God, it's a Don Corneo. 
What is he holding? Two, like, light sticks? It's like a Don Corneo jukebox with eyes. Oh, it's a vetting machine. Oh, God, I get to die of the slug and his theme. Oh, God, he's even got his face on there. Taking a, <laughs> disconnecting a strange song. Yeah, that sounds about right. This goofy ass music. <laughs> my new hit single, baby. Oh my god, look at all this shit. Look at all this weird kinky shit down here. Uh, and a chest. It's got a dildo in there. Bottle of turbo ether. Oh god, this strap chair strap here. Uh oh yep, they got the thing you lie down on. Oh, tie me down, daddy, yeah. Well, this really does look more like a torture den than a sex dungeon. Seriously, like, what, what's all the tools? This is a, I mean, right? I mean, I know some people are like, they, well, I guess some BDSM stuff, but like, this is, I didn't think they really, really try to hurt you too bad. This is like, I don't know. These tools look a little more extreme, I, I think. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah. No. Yeah? No! Yes! So in the, before the original, they didn't knock you out. They just, you just went down there and, uh, oh, she's in my party now. Uh, you just went down there and like found Tifa. Cause like, they were like, oh, you have a few minutes before you come in here. So you just looked around the manor and found Tifa down here. Oh my God. I cannot wait to see how this next part's going to go. <laughs> how is this crazy next part going to proceed? It's a door there. I can't go through. Okay. I think if I have to choose between Aerith and Tifa's outfits here, Aerith does look fucking gorgeous. I do love it. But I think I kind of give it to get it to Tifa. That exotic one. I think if I had to compare what Tifa's like purple outfit does, because I have seen what her original, her other two outfits look like. Which what, one, which which you guys point out, makes it look like Chun Li, which is also super fucking cute. And if I had to pick that between the original purple dress and this one, I'd probably give it to Aerith, even though the the purple dress does uh, definitely let the ladies breathe a bit more. But I don't know. I just, this this is so cute. I'm so glad I went with the exotic one. What really makes me laugh, though, is that the fact is, you know that Tifa now bought this dress because she had intended to go on this date with Cloud, right? She wasn't really going to use this for, for this situation. She got this dress because she was going on a date with Cloud. And I find that so fucking adorable. Okay. Let's get out of the sex dungeon. This is... <laughs> we'll save this for later. Oh, God. How disgusting is the dog going to be? Okay, my beautiful ladies. Time to line up for the dog. Koch. <sighs> yeah, girl. Wait, you look kind of familiar. <laughs> we haven't met before, have we? Mm -mm. No, we didn't beat you up in the arena. <laughs> Whatever. All right, y'all good to go? Then let's do this. It's about to get weird, guys. Hope you're ready. Wilson Walmart's most eligible bachelor, the one and only Don Corneo. Ladies. Uh. Oh my God, he's poking set around the corner. Nice, very nice. Oh my god! <laughs> Double hair in his chest! Whichever one shall I pick? Mm. Oh. This music! Shall I pick you? <laughs> or maybe you? Oh my god, he's perfect. Yeah. He's so fucking <laughs> scummy and slimy looking. Mm. Ooh. Ooh, you're fit. Oh, okay. There's no, okay. No, I'm not doing anything. And then originally you didn't do anything either. He just picked, but it was based on your, you know, decisions. But who had the previous dress? There's nothing. Okay. Wow. Will he pick me then? Or will he pick one of the other ladies? I don't know. I don't know if there's any decision here or not. Well, let's, let's see. Fan tomorrows or the day after. If the Don takes a shine to you. Oh God. Pathetic. 
Huh? <laughs> Pathetic. Hey, which one of you said that? He's got his you. fucking beer belly. Ooh, you got a mouth on you. I'm gonna enjoy breaking it in. Today's lucky lady is the big bone girl. Oh my god, yes! <laughs> Still playing hard to get? I can dig it. I can dig it. Oh yeah. Leftovers are all yours. <laughs> oh my god, okay. I think this is just gonna play out this way regardless. Oh my god. Don't be shy, little kitten. Shimmy on over and give daddy some sugar. Oh, that was it. That was the, that was the line we heard from the trailer. I thought it sounded like, it's still sounded like Mark Hamill. No need to play coy. Nobody here but you and me. Oh, you're even cuter than I thought. Back off. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> this kitten's got claws. I love it. <laughs> god, that belly. <laughs> What was that? Don't you worry, your pretty little head. Just a picture to preserve the moment. And to don't blackmail sure me later. Anything inappropriate, like say no, asshole. Oh, <laughs> asshole. <brains me more. laughs> Where's my sword? Hey, yo, fellas. We got guests, and y'all huh? got first crack at entertaining them. I hope, we, I hope we fight in these outfits. Fight, girls. See the ever generous Don Corneo himself. Never forget the Don provides. Yeah. Good day. Kick their asses, lady. So, ladies. Ladies. Ready to. Oh yeah, we are. Yeah. I guess I'm good to go whenever. How about you, Tifa? <laughs> Four guys between us. Okay, let's not keep Cloud waiting. Right. Wait. I know you. The Coliseum. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, in the face. <laughs> Woo! Don't you stupid. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Get him with the chair. Boom. Get him, girls. Nothing compared to you. <laughs> now they're best friends. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't have to teach you how to high five like Cloud. <sighs> oh. Andrea filled me in on the situation. I come very. Oh my and God, he was the inside person. How about that? He knows. Andrea Maybe knows I people. This up. Just finish the job. Cool. Thank you. This music man. Atta boy, young Seth Noctis. Yazora. Okay, let's go rescue Cloud. Corneo's room, right? Alright, come on, Aerith. Let's do a funny little walk out of here. But first, grab the stuff. Ba -da 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 -da. No, I, I think he's just gonna pick Cloud every time, right? I think I think that's the, the point here. Which I think it works. I mean, it's just it's it's so much funnier when he picks Cloud. Alright, Cloud, we're gonna get you sore too. I'm guessing we're all uh, equipped up and everything, right? Yeah. Thanks, man. Man, I love to spend some quality time with treads like that. Never hurry. Lucky bastard. Gonna fuck these guys up. I see you've you got this. Let out, me handle huh? this. Get him, Tiva! Holy fuck, Tiva! Fuck that guy up. He's got thunder elemental on right now. Power. God, it's even so much fun to fucking control. Okay. Uh, over here? Wait, no. This way. Where am I going? Oh, over here. Okay. Hey, we got chest over here. Oh, is this optional? Fury ring. Oh, this, is actually, this isn't the way to go. Oh, it's an optional thing. What's that do? A ring for warriors who wish to tap into their more feral side. Enter battle with the berserk status effect. 
Wow, cool. What does the Berserk do in this instance? I mean, I can still control them. I think Cloud gets it when he uh, does his one move. That's right. Exchange defense for strength. More damage is dealt and received. I don't know. Do I want that? Would I want that for like Tifa, maybe? I'm going to give it a try to see how well it works. It might be a bad idea, but we'll see. <laughs> little Aeris little run. Uh, okay, not going that way. Uh, spec down to the sex dungeon. Uh, yeah. This song almost sounds like a theme from Final Fantasy VI. Da -da -da, da -da -da -da. I think it's Terra's theme. Oh, almost. It's, it's not. It's not quite the same, but. What up? Hey, you two, the rejects! Oh, she actually gets it. I think the the, the berserk stays on her permanently. Yeah, it doesn't go away. Oh, big punch! That's a win. Fuck him up, Tifa. Uh, what about over here? Oh no, this is the sex dungeon. What was that area back behind the the, the door then? I wonder. Or behind the bookcase. Because that's where they took us before, wasn't it? Oh my god, I hope we I hope we threatened to fucking cut off uh, the Don's balls. What are we doing in the original game? <laughs> Don't stop. Tell me what you a bad boy I bastard. am. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes I am! Here I come, baby! <laughs> hey, who the hell gave you permission to do that? One of you get in here and teach this bitch some manners. Sorry, but your boys had to learn some manners too. What the? Cloud, your clothes. I think fuck. <gasps> Oh. Ah, <laughs> the slow realization. So you're a man, huh? What are you three up to? We'll ask the questions. Like, why'd you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Nah. Huh? Don't know what you're talking about. Don't play dumb with me. Let's try again. Why did you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Spill the beans, or... I'll cut them off. Yes! All right, all right, I'll talk, I'll talk! <laughs> yes! Hmm. Uh, some guy with a gun for an arm. I was paid to find him. Paid by who? I can't tell you that. They'd hunt me down like a dog. Well, you better. Because if you don't, I'll rip them off. <laughs> yes. We fucking did it. It was the director of public security, Heidegger. It was Heidegger. Shinra. And what were they planning? Some things are better left unsaid, you know. See, I'm not so sure they are. Better keep talking. Or I'll smash them. Smash your dick, boy. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I like that though. <laughs> All right, you got me. I could never say no to a sexy girl. Since Avalanche blew up two reactors, Shinra's decided they ought to stamp them out, home base and all. And I mean, stamp out. By targeting the support pillar and blowing it up. The pillar? Did I stutter? The plate will come crushing down. It'll be Sector 6 all over again. I'm sure you've been there and seen the wreckage for yourself. So you know exactly what Sector 7 is going to look like. They wouldn't. Come on, guys. We gotta go. Before you do. No. Please, this won't take long. No. Move, Cloud. As everyone knows. Villains only divulge their plans in a certain situation. But what is that situation? <laughs> Move, guys! Mm. Mm. Oh my god! Here we go! He's actually gonna ask me. Mm. 
when they think they've already won. Right? Correct! Ladies and gentlemen, we have ourselves a winner! <laughs> He's you fucking dancing! Expenses paid trip to the sewers. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Why does he have that installed in there? <laughs> Enjoy the sights and smells! <laughs> Crook, pull the lever! Never the bride. Oh my god, that was amazing! Fucking amazing. Yes, and they did it. They did talk about mutilating the Don's balls. Yes. I was hoping to God they would do that. Oh, God. Meanwhile, at Shinra headquarters. Are we on the schedule? <laughs> the Turks are on top of it. Yes, there will be no delays. Please, Mr. President. I am asking you to reconsider. Oh, Reeve. No, begging. The Sector 7 Undercity is home to more than 50,000. <sighs> Director Twisty. At least let us issue a warning, sir. The stench of the Director's cowardice fills the room yet again. <laughs> Reeve. Progress requires sacrifice. Reef looks great. Learn to live with it. Dank doo doo. Damn it, Reeks. <gasps> Guys, get up. Sector 7. Yeah. That bastard! Yeah, fuck him! Oh shit. I think he's coming, guys. Oh god! I remember you! Abzu! I can remember you from the trailers as well. Oh my god! <laughs> oh fuck, here we go, guys! Here we go. You bet. Bring it on. Let's do this! <laughs> Damn it, Abzu, a lot fucking cooler looking than it was in the original game! So in the original game, actually, Abzu... Oh, he's weak to fire. Chef, I'd be weak to lightning. That's why I put lightning on uh, Tifa's fists. Oh, well. Um, in the original game, he actually only had one move. They just did spam again and again. It was this move where he held water on top of you. That's all he did. That's literally the only move he had. A giant piece that Don Corneo keeps in the sewers. Much more intelligent than it appears. He uses the surrounding environment to his advantage and attacks with sewer water. Match attacks only have a slight effect on a gauge. Nice attacks have no effect on the gauge at all. Uh, okay. Ah, uh, come on, dude. Let's get that shit. Power. Power. What the fuck? Aerith, it's your time to shine. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. You get over. Uh -oh. So it's my turn? Yes. Uh oh. He's sad. 
Okay. Um. Oh, that's right. Uh, Flee familiar. Don't let him stop us. Okay. Um. Now arcane ward. This one's for you. Okay. Uh. She. Have... Yeah. She has fire. All right. Let's get um. Big fiction. Ah, oh, yeah! Burn, dickhead! Okay. Oh, man, did a fuck ton of damage! Oh, he jumped in the water! Put out the fire! I'm gonna call you on fire again, ha! Oh, actually, his horns have uh, hitbox on them, too. Uh oh. Take it over. I'm gonna hit you with this shit, motherfucker. Uh, oh, I think I missed. Uh oh. Oh, fuck, he's fucking pissed. Do, 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 Let's uh, put bear on everybody. Mm -hmm. Come on out, motherfucker. Gotta get for ya. Damn, this guy's fucking melting right now. Uh-oh. Oh, God, here it comes. Run. Run. Things are coming. Oh, my God. Excuse me, ladies. I said run! That's, uh... That's not good. Still up here. Keep it together. <gasps> dit, dit. Okay, uh, wait. I got this. I got this, I think. <laughs> Fuck, that is so much dumb damage. You okay? Oh, ah, okay. Uh, nobody has enough. Oh wait, not even me? Oh, I need two for this. That was normally just okay. Whatever. Um, big cure myself. Ain't dead yet. Ain't dead yet. Okay. Uh, Aerith. Come on, you can do it. Shoot from a distance. Okay. Back. Oh fuck! He's still alive. Cure yourself. Oh, that was close. Yes, and Tiva cured. All right, good. Come on. Oh my God! What the fuck? Are you kidding me? Let's switch it up. Holy fuck! They did so much damage. Why? Why did that do so much damage? I'm here. Cloud, can you? Uh, no. No. Oh god, oh god. Wow, I was like melting this guy and then just... What? This. Oh. What the fuck just happened? What just happened? Oh my god! Why? Why did that happen? He did so much damage suddenly. At the end he just like, just fucked us up. Jesus Christ, okay. From checkpoint, I'm gonna change out some materia here. I'm gonna put fire on her fists. Fuck, man. I was like, I thought I was like, man, this is, e this is actually pretty easy. And then all of a sudden, that water move hits, kills us all, and then that they start charging at us, and that just <laughs> he did, all three of us immediately killed us. Wow. Okay. Damn. I was not expecting that. It was a sudden spike in uh difficulty there, wasn't it? Oh, fuck. How far back did this take me? Oh, no. That's that take me real far back, isn't it? This is refresh try from checkpoint. It's taking me back before I even got the dress, isn't it? Maybe so I can like train. Fuck. Yeah, it is. Holy fuck. Well, I appreciate it. It's, it's thinking about me. Oh, oh, here we go. That's right. I can actually 
I forgot I have control there, so I can change stuff out here. All right, I'm going to press, press C for this time, just because I'm kind of curious to see if it changes the scene at all. Tifa? Oh, uh, Cloud. We have to get back to the slums right now. Yeah. I didn't want to drag Aerith into all this. I actually did a little bit. Understand. How do you two know each other? Oh, wow. It's actually a bit more. I saved her. She saved me. Round and round it goes. And that's all there is to it. Sure there isn't something else going on? Oh, shit. I'm getting the business with fucking Tifa here. Damn it. <laughs> All right, here we go. Deal with that. Is this guy flexing? I think he is. Here goes. Oh, wait, that's right. I got to scan him again. Fuck, dude. Allow me. Keep it together. Power. More power. I'll take care of them. Na, 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 na. Oh, God damn it. He always, he always goes for fucking Aerith. Might need to start going for the horns here or something. Yeah, the horns are what's uh, casting these. Deadly spells here. <laughs> yeah, he does. He flexes. <laughs> He's like, yeah. Oh, we got stunned or something. Uh. Ifrit. Get your fat ass down here. Ah, I am the god of here I am. Oh, always Eric. Fucking hell. I'm ending this. I'm ending this. Ah. Keep it together. Ah. Burn as all. Okay, everybody move the living shit out of the way. I can't fucking okay. Move. Everybody move. Wh which one is to come? It's come from that one. Stay over here. There we go. Yeah, he, ch he chooses one of these for it to come out of, I see. Boom. Fire! Burn ticket! Oh my god, she looks so fucking crazy. I love it. Oh my god, that's a fucking lot of damage. Ah, damn, he went in the water. There we go. Immediately just out of water, immediately hit him with again. The barrier on. It's your turn. Take it over. Take it over. Uh, fuck, I missed. Deal with that. Get him, Tiva. Uh, Almost dead. Kill him. 
Got him. Oh! You just gotta really, uh... Gotta whittle him down. Fast. Before he gets those moves out. Ah, right, come on. We're... Are we still going? Ah! He's like, fuck you guys, I'm out of here. Do you leave it? There it goes. Bye. Do you think it lives down here or? It was probably Corneo's pet. And we were dinner. <laughs> you don't believe that crazy story of his, do you? Shinra wouldn't sacrifice a whole sector just to take out Avalanche, would they? Destroying part of the city, killing all those people just to get at us? I've seen the future. Know. Is Corneo the kind of guy who'd make up shit just to screw with you? I wouldn't put it past him. But if he was telling the truth, hmm? and there's still a chance he was, isn't there? Then we should go. And if it turns out he was lying, then so what? Right? Mm. Hmm? Uh, uh, Tifa! Oh. Ow! I knew it. These tunnels are all connected. Anything around here? No. Holy! Abzu hit fucking hard, man. Abzu! I didn't even actually get a chance to, to stagger him, though. Hey, how's it going? Oh, yeah, I didn't even steal anything from him. Oh, whatever. It's just, it's, it's just a turbo ether. Who gives a shit? What is it? I'm pretty sure we can use these tunnels to make our way back to Sector 7. The sewers under Sector 6 and 7 should be connected. If you get in trouble, just follow the stench. Another one of those lessons? An avalanche saying, actually. We use them to move around the Undercity in emergencies. Hmm. Sure we're not lost? Positive. Follow the waterway. waterway just up ahead. Let's find you missed this chest back here, Tiva. Okay, they're going to expand out. I, I kind of had a feeling this would happen. They're going to expand out the sewer section, which <laughs> I will say does kind of suck only because nobody likes sewer sections, right? In the original game, you weren't in the sewers for like that long at all, like for two seconds before you get to uh, the, the train graveyard, which is the area right after this. But they're going to extend this one out quite a bit, which I'm not surprised. I, I kind of saw it coming. So see, all, like you land the sewers, you fight Abzu immediately in the original game. You walk like two screens and you're out of the sewers. <laughs> it's like you are not in there long. All right, ladies, let's get out of here. Hope there's a bench or something nearby because... Oh, fuck me. What the hell? The Hagen? Sewer people. Oh, I actually recognize this monster. Weak to fire too, huh? Quad creatures that have taken up residence in the sewers. They're intelligent enough to have created their own language <laughs> and, they, and politics. They defend their territory with harpoons of their own fashioning. Uh, okay. It's on you. Built that stagger gate. Boom. Booyah, baby. Oh, man, knock the fuck out of him. Okay, might want to heal ourselves then. <laughs> bump, bump, bump. Don't look at my skirt, Cloud! Tifa, I see up your skirt all the time when we're fighting. Oh, yeah. Hi, potions. Ooh, I like this music. Uh, uh, I think we're gonna have to drain water, aren't we? Yep, there's a switch here. Drain the water from the sewer. Cause that's what you do when you're in a sewer. Oh, wait, I'm not in front of the switch. Gotta drain out that doo doo! Oh, hey, special chest over there. Don't want to miss out on that. Ladies, you almost missed out on this awesome chest over here. Weapon for Tifa, a pair of feather gloves. Feathers? Star shower. Lightweight gloves embellished with 
feathers. Um, unleash a flurry of powerful strikes. Increase the strength of next command executed. Oh, cool. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. That's fucking awesome. <laughs> Look at her bouncing on her feet like... <laughs> Follow up with offensive ability or magic after using the, the weapon ability. So I need to also use uh, Eris so she can learn hers. Wow, the strength of these are actually pretty good already. Uh, okay, let me go ahead and upgrade them. How about I can get at least one linked together? Um, attack power, speed, magic, physical damage reduction when guarding, magic damage reduction, attack damage 5%, aerial attack damage, ATB charge rate, rear assault, stagger siphon. Stagger siphon. Recover HP when dealing damage with unique abilities to a staggered enemy. Oh, that's cool. Wow, neat. Uh, new material slot. Whoa, activation 70%. That's a lot. She does not have any link to though. So, okay. I mean, I can't do what I'm doing here, pretty much. Definitely want that. She's almost, almost guaranteed to have that, and then when she goes into a fight. Okay, attack power. Uh, let's get that stagger siphon. That's pretty, pretty good. Uh, ATB charge rate. More attack damage. And we'll go speed, too. This one seems to be all about that speed, though. Increase how much... How quickly her ATB will go up, basically. Put first strike on her. Uh, what does this do? Anything? Oh, it fills it back up again. Why would I want to do that? Uh, I don't know. Why would I want to do that? Hey, a bench. And music. The Oppressed. Just seeing a jazzy song. I still don't get anything new yet, though. Not sure if I recognize this song. Yeah, I don't rec recognize her off the bat. I'm sure it is based off another song, but I can't hear it. All right, let's move Cloud. Oh, fuck. Oh, yep, concentration activated. Cool. Where rats? And they're dead already. Nothing to it. God, we're still fighting fucking rats. These guys, these guys die so fast now, too. Uh, better go ahead and switch out uh, Tifa's ability here with her new one. Hey, what the fuck is that? Crap, people, crap, people. Scissor claw. Scissor claw. <laughs> Clark crustaceans that dwell in the sewers. They feed on dead bodies. They're washed into the sewers. Ew, they're rather territorial, attacking any and all intruders they see with their giant claws. They're big, meaty claws. Star shower. Ow, I did that one great. Oh, okay. What? So it's uh, my turn? Yeah, I think it's your turn. Oh, wow. Okay. And then Aerith kind of melted it. Uh, we got a door over here. I think it's probably where I'm trying to go. Uh, we have over here. Anybody? Oh, locked door. Aerith, watch out! Those cranks are gonna get you! Ah! Ah, don't worry, Aerith, you're safe now. Wow, thanks a lot, Cloud. This is like the same thing. This is like the same symbol we saw with those the door earlier. Is that like the Dawn symbol? Double dragons. I never got in that room either with the materia and the, the all those sweet boxes that I could freaking break. Ah, it kills me even to this day. I'm hoping at some point I can go back there and get it. Uh, I've got two ways to go. I seem to leave the same place, but it's really dark. I'm sure we'll be fine. Come on. Hey, Cloud. Well, we go this way. Assuming Corneo was telling us the truth, what do you think Shinra's really up to? I mean, they've got to have an end game. But I can't imagine to what rule the world. This Holy shit, it is very dark in here. To get back at us doesn't make any kind of sense. Yeah, I can't imagine any way they could profit from it. 
It's gonna cost them a fortune to rebuild. So switch there. Neo's lying. He's gotta be. Guys like him do it all the time out of habit. Turn the lights on or something. Walk faster, Cloud. It's not that dark. Hey, give me that power switch. That's a power generator, all right. Wow, talk about ancient. It's an antique, older than the Mako reactors even. It'll be a miracle if it still works. Let's find out by holding that triangle button. Uh, ah. And it does. But first. Hey, would you look at that? <sighs> and let there be light. I'll protect you. Ah, oh, fuck. I'm pretty good at protecting myself, you know. Ow. Here goes. Taste the power of crab. Eat this bitch. Up. Go on. It's like they block your attack. Ow! They block your attack, but they have so little health, it still like melts super fast. Uh, okay. Guess we'll go lower the water then. Slurp? Whee! Ooh, I see something down there. <gasps> Is that some blue materia? Uh, oh. Key? Key to... <gasps> that might be the key to that door back there. Back the way I came, I bet it is. Oh shit, I'm be going through that door this time. I'm not fucking up now. There's gonna be some boxes down there. I'm gonna break them so fucking good. Cloud, I think you need to come. Shut up, Kiva. We need to get back there now. There's no time. Before I do that, hold on. What's on this side? Gotta drain the water here too. Slurpity derp. Anything? Oh, yep, there's a chest. 800 gil. Who keeps putting money down here? Was it stupid? No, we'll find my hidden booty of 800 gil in the dirty doo doo water. Guess again, Captain Ahab. Ah, curses ye cloud. You stinky scallywag, you. Oh, God, the crap came back. <laughs> hey, deadly dodge material is up. All right, cool. Die, Mr. Crab. That's a win. Watch out for the pools of poison. All right, cool. That improves its... It just says it improves the ability of it. Yeah, increased potency and effects. I guess it just does more damage and pulls people in more or something. Nothing? Really? I got a key! Try the dumb key you just got, Cloud. Ah, oh, wouldn't make any sense. Found at the bomb... A key to the sewer gates found at the bottom of the channel. Oh. Huh. Maybe it's... Maybe it's for up ahead then. Oh, oh, I was so excited. I was so excited, guys. I thought I did good, but I guess not. Stamp. It oh, worked. it was this door. <laughs> Never mind. Of course. Uh, ooh, green hey, material. I know this place. Sector seven should be just on the other side of this waterway. Oh, good. So this is where Sector 6 ends. That was fast. And where Sector 7 begins. Once we cross over, we can start looking for a way back to the surface. Trunk line. Might be harder than you think. Let's just try to make our way down this tunnel. See if we can't use those gates to clear a path. We can do this. We'll figure it out. Yeah, for sure. We're all super smart. I went to college. Yeah, I... Did I go to college? I don't remember. I see more rats and flying fishies. God, these doors again? Seriously. Sit seriously. Ah, oh, damn it. So it's my turn? Back me up, okay? Dead, 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 dead. Was never in doubt. God, they see so quickly. It's like enemies from like the like two like two or three dungeons ago, but they don't seem like they got any stronger. They're just like, ah, eh, we're back here for some reason. Anyway, I'm dead already. Is this locked again? Fucking hell. Why? Why would you do this? Maybe this is like 
This is like something for like end game. Can you like come back here and uh, like have some special key to get this stuff? Maybe. Can I see anything on this side? Any treasure or anything? We got boxes. Get this crap out of here. Literal crap. Here we go. Yeah, there are crabs and fishies down there. Like, hey, I needed that. You dick. Sorry. Crap, people. All right. Clean familiar learned. It's going to fill the water back up again. Would I want to do that? Uh, oh, yeah, I do. Because then it'll make a little, it'll make a path here. But before I do, um, hey, I see you. Poison materia. Nothing in the boxes. Crossing the sluice gate. Yes, I, I get it. I get a game. It's not that hard to figure out. Oh, it just lowers it. Okay. I was going to fill it back up with water again. Careful. Careful, cloud. Okay. Oh, God. I got you. There's a guy just chilling out down here. Let's kill him! <laughs> I'll hear a moment I approach. Dima's like, MOTHERFUCKER! Time to die! Jesus Christ, calm down, Dima! Fuck! That didn't need to be so messy. <laughs> Jesus Christ, you're the one who fucking curb stopped him to oblivion, Dima. He didn't even let me crush his skull in cloud. You decided that, Tifa. You. So it says this increases the strength of the next command executed. But if I immediately attack afterwards, to, like with just a physical attack, does that count? Because I'm not actually, I don't think I've been getting the proficiency bonus after I do this move. Because I, because I don't have quite enough ATB to do something else. God, I love that. Tifa, I think it's the coolest fucking moves in this game, though. Like, this just looks so cool. I like it. She just stops for a second and starts bouncing around her feet like, all right, all right, I'm going to do this. Gonna <laughs> so fucking cool. But it might mean you have to build up like two ATB gauges if you want to immediately jump into the next one. Because it might be that like, if fo your follow-up offensive ability, I mean, it says ability. So one thing it just means, or it just increases the strength of the next command executed. So I don't know, it might just be your next punch also gets increased. But I, I don't think I've been getting the, uh, the proficiency bonus, which kind of leads me to believe that that isn't the case. Uh, okay, we got another switch. Moogle metal. I wonder if there's any more Moogle metal stuff. I, I'd imagine there probably is. I can't imagine that that little Moogle dude just shows up in that one spot. Uh. Whoa! Oh, that's, now we should be able to get across. That's incredibly convenient. Well, those little platforms didn't move at all for some reason. <laughs> Even though they are not tied to the ground. I'll go first. Okay. Uh oh. I can't stop thinking about what Corneo said. I know. Me too. It's gotta be a trick. There's no way they'd go that far. But... But what if Corneo really was telling the truth? We have to get there in time to stop it. We have to. Maybe we should stop talking and get going! <sighs> Aerith, what are you not telling me? Huh? Uh-oh. Uh Guys, come on. We gotta keep moving. Coming. I'll go first. Mm. <sighs> okay, Aerith, your turn. On my way. Here we go. Got a bad feeling. We're almost there. I got you, girl. 
Oh. Yeah. Thanks. You saved me. <laughs> Least I could do. I almost fell out of the poo. That cloud? <laughs> Whatever. Come on. The fuck do those things things sing for? Girls are too busty. <laughs> No going back. What was it using to keep it afloat? At first, I thought it was just like two inflatable things, but then it looked like two giant uh, canisters or something. Focus. Still thinking about the plate? Yeah. The future isn't set in stone. That's what I always tell myself. Yeah. I hope you're right. How about this then? Think of something fun. After saving Sector 7, you're gonna... I'm gonna... Go shopping. Topside. I'll buy stuff for the bar. Decorations. Coasters. Can I come? You'd better. Then it's a date. <laughs> <laughs> Girl time! Fuck you, clown! I'll carry all our stuff. <laughs> He'll be our pack chocobo. Hey! What was that about me? Nothing. <laughs> oh, I do like their bonding. Oh, fuck me. I told you girls are too busty. Ah, shit. Why always me? Oh, got it. Thanks, ladies. Sorry about that. Thank God you're also jacked. Be... <sighs> so you know, at least a hundred of those pounds was that sore on my back. All right, I'm not fat. Hmm. Thing with te with Aerith there is sort of interesting. I'm. I don't know. It's like, what is it? What are you not telling us? Did she like. Just that she's like, well, I know Corneo, and he's the kind of guy who would totally do that, or... I don't know. It's, it's kind of weird. I'm not really sure what it means. Okay, are we... Almost out of the sewers? Possibly? Oh, no, actually, I think we're... We just got through the transitionary period between Sector 7 and Sector 6, so... Holy shit, there's a lot of stuff in those boxes. So now I think we gotta go through the sewers here. But first... Potions! Oh, I need a quick pick-me-up, guys. Uh, all this excitement. No, no music this time. Uh, time to pop a squat. Uh, uh, uh. This extends the duration of beneficial status effects. I wonder if that means just for her. Or if it means when she casts it on everybody, it will do it for everyone. I think probably just her, but get it anyway. Uh, okay, we got a few ways to go. Uh, all right, I guess we'll go right then. Wait, maybe? I think I see a chest down here, though. And a rat! No! We're doomed! We're doomed! Oh god, there's more behind us! Whatever. Whatever. No! Overkill, Tifa! Two orbs of gravity! Oh, another tight squeeze. Oh god, more crabs. Dr. Zoyberg! I hate Dr. Zoeberg. He must pay for his I'm sins. I'm good at protecting myself, you know. Yeah. Ah, fuck you. Stop guarding, dickhead. Okay, so I'm gonna try this again. I'm not gonna do anything else. Okay, stagger this asshole. Now hit him with a dive kick. Uh, did I hit him? I'm not sure if I did. Well, we acquired it. I was trying to get that proficiency of the ability. I'm not sure if I actually got it, though. All right, cool. Got this ability. In which case, I'm going to go back to the Sonic Strikers. To use more of her uh, elemental stuff. I haven't tried out the new Deadly Dodge when it's upgraded. Not sure if it's going to look any different, but... Uh, okay. Two ways to go again. Oh, Lord. No, this is definitely uh, more of this place. Dun-dun. 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 This, this won't take long, Blue Goo. All right, yeah, I've got these guys scanned. Level up for Tifa. Tifa, get out of the goop! Tifa! <laughs> just standing there. 
Uh, oh god, I see some, I see some blue shit, baby. On the other side. No, I want it. I want it. How the fuck do I get it? It's impossible. Is it store locked? No. Uh, that is definitely the way to go. Okay, I'm going the right way. Which you know what that means? Let's go the wrong way. Oh God, get him, Tifa! Oh, I feel so fucking go. good. Got just on that side too, and I think I see some fishy people. All right, well that mystery was solved quite easily. How do we get it? How do we? Oh, we just loop around. We just we just loop around. Warding materia. Ooh, what be that? Uh, grants resistance to the linked materia status ailment. Works with poison, time, bind, and subversion materia. Reduce debuff duration by 25%. Oh, wow. Interesting. Cool. Wow, it takes a lot to level up. I mean, for poison, all I would need... I, I've got also an accessory that prevents that. And this only decreases its duration. I mean, it'll do it by 100%, which means that I'm guessing that it's essentially resisting it, right? I think. What's subversion? Sleep, maybe? I don't think I've actually gotten that yet, no. But it's clear then that means we do get time material, which is going to probably have, like slow and haste and things. I don't, yeah, I don't know what subversion is, but if you do it with bind, that's actually pretty good because then you would get all the things attached to it, which is multiple things. Sleep, uh, silence, and berserk. I, I think, unless these also have to be leveled up so that I can use those. So I don't know. I wonder if it has to be on armor. Probably not. Hello, fish man. Don't hold that. Dun, 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 dun. <gasps> oh, I got the frog! <laughs> oh my god! I didn't even realize Tifa turned to a frog! <laughs> She's still kicking ass even as a frog, though. <laughs> she was using the tongue to go, bat. The attack. <laughs> oh my god, the frog stats effect. Oh my god, that's so funny. I think it was actually wearing her clothes, too. Her little tank top on. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. Finally got to see it. Okay, I think it's uh, everything over here. Okay. Look, Are we there yet? The oh, yes. All right. Cool. I wonder. There must be some way we can lower the water level. I'm not swimming in the pool. Yes, you are. It's the only way to save Sector 7. Eh, whatever. I didn't like it that much anyway. Ooh, a big button. Or er, switch. Guys, check it out. Seventh Heaven's water tank has something similar. I'm betting we can use this to control the sewage level. Hey, Cloud, you want to give it a try? This ought to drain the water, right? Just pull, all right? We've done it a few times now. It's not too confusing. No luck? Pump has not been turned on. A red light indicates a blockage, apparently. Uh-oh. We can use the hand pump to clear the blockage. Sounds about right. I remember having to do this at the bar before. Gross. All right. I'll... Aerith, you mind giving me a hand? Cloud, you stay put. Keep an eye out for more red lights. <laughs> Wait, I'm not sure. Trust me, this is the best way to handle it. We'll be back soon. Oh, I'm be lonely though. <sighs> Fine. Don't worry. Got it. Don't worry, I'm gonna stand here and guard this wall, I guess. Marty Lonely! Trying some one on one girl time. I get it. I get it. So maybe this is a little different from the one at the bar. More industrial? Oh my god, what is this? How to operate the waste pump, wa wastewater pump. Have Aerith open the valve. Tilt up to open the valve. The needle will start to swing from left to right. Have Tifa work the work that pump uh, 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 while the needle's moving. Press X. Uh, repeatedly hit X to expand the target range. Have Aerith close the valve as the indicator's hand swings back to the right. Uh, tilt L down with the target range to close the valve. Okay. okay. Oh, okay. I think I think I get it. 
Okay, up. That's the tiny little... Oh, 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 I see. Oh, gotta go. Yeah. Uh oh. Try to stay in sync. Gotta, gotta go down. I, I let go of it. Oh, now it made it easier for me. <laughs> Fuck. Keep calm. Okay, it's 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 literally instantaneous. So don't need to worry about it sliding or something. Yeah. Okay. You go, girlfriend. Did 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 did. Pop it, pop it, pop it, pop it, pop it. Ooh, that's uh, a little difficult. Could have gone better. Fuck! I am not super good at this. There we go. Ding. Now it's very, very tiny. Oh, fuck you very much. Do you see how fast that one went? What the shit? That went crazy fast. There we go. Mine. Right. I think that did it. Wonderful. Okay, let's head back. Cloud's probably getting worried. Cloud's sleeping in there. Uh, no talk? I thought we were going to be like talking. That's the reason why they... Because they just want... I think they just wanted some... Some jiggly fan service. I don't know. All right. Hey, I thought I was going to pull switch. Oh, why am I even here? Wee! Nicely done. We make a great team. Go team. Yeah, me too. I'm part of the team. Don't hold back. You got uh, what? Oh! Ah! Keep it together. Keep it tight. Hey, shit, motherfucker! Damn it. I need more power. Ugh. Ow! Boom! Stagger the fuck out of this piece of shit! Ugh. Ah. Gotcha. Ow! Eat this! Uh -huh. blah, 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 blah. Ah. A bottle of adrenaline! I don't think Tifa needs that. We got more shit down here too. More boxes! Don't close your eyes. <laughs> Don't hit the bubbles, damn it. So it's my turn? Fuck these little fish assholes. I am so fucking sick of you. Just for that, you're fucking dead. Eat this. I keep my distance. <laughs> Can you take over for me? Let's do this. My material level up. Alright, cool. Oh god, we're frogs! <laughs> Look at a little frog cloud. He got a star on his back. Ah! Get him, cloud! Ah! Just, just Bubble breath. Eat this. Blah. Keep going. <laughs> uh, I love how cute and hilarious that is. Ah! Uh, that tells me in all the right places. I tell you what. Oh god. Deal with that. To limit me on. Hang in there. This fight's not over yet. Ah. <laughs> Fucking hell. Huh? 
<laughs> Get up, Diva. I don't know. Tifa might be too squishy for having a... Oh, God. That fury ring on. Fuck me, man. I think we're almost done. I tried. Jesus Christ! Deal with that. Is there another one coming? What the fuck is happening? Sorry, but I got him. This one's for you. Oh, he came back. He dived in and came back. Oh god. Go on. Fuck you. Get out of here. You're burning up. Gotta go for it now. Whew. Hang back. I'll go on ahead and secure the exit. Ah, shit, more fish people. Oh, fuck. Uh, that's a lot of fish people. Looks like they're hungry for more. We're not delicious. Not even a little bit. Nah. Get going. There's no time. Okay. <laughs> yeah, push the fuck out, fish, fish man. But there's too many of them. Not for me. Hurry. My HP's kind of low, but yeah, okay. Ah! Back off or die. Crap, people. Can't understand you. Come on. They're coming to get me. Thank God they don't want to climb ladders. Sewer survivor. Chapter 11 Haunted. I see a purple chest. Uh oh. What the fuck? Understood. Oh. The Shit. mission has been approved. We ought to proceed as planned. Uh, this is bullshit. What the hell are they thinking? Threats to public order are to be summarily put down. This is what we've always done. Summarily put down. It's a little late to grow a conscience. <sighs> no, Reno, no. <sighs> Just on patrol. Don't worry, we'll make it in time. Oh, I got healed. Good. Any good stuff here? Or just the same bullshit? I think just the same bullshit. All right, guys. Uh, I think we're probably pretty far in this episode. I don't want to stop. This game is so much fucking fun. But I think I'm going to have to end things here for now. Anyway, hopefully we can get over to uh, the pillar by next episode. Be heading through the, the train graveyard first. Lord knows, though, when we do get over there, things are going to get uh, oh, pretty hairy and probably pretty heavy. I'm kind of dreading it, actually, <laughs> for a few reasons. Oh, God. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please leave a like and a favorite and subscribe and already become Peaky Penguin for the SLP, where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. And as always, guys, till next time, stay classy.